Okay, I'm here to show you how to make this card really quick and easy, and I love the look. So I like the gray and the pink. So anyways, I wanted to share it. So let's get started. Um, this is uh, Smoky Slate, and I am folding it in half. Now this is a five and a half by eight and a half. And I'm folding it in half. I'm crisping it down. And then I'm going to take a smoky um, basic gray stamp pad and I'm going to load up my hardwood stamp that I have and notice this is a big one anytime you get a big one like this load it upside down that way you can see where the ink is and then have you a spare piece of paper so you can take and I fold it in half, notice, and I'm laying it up here. Now you can do this with a piece of scrap paper. It comes out pretty good every time. If you have a brayer, brayer works good too. So there you go. All right. All right, so the next thing I'm going to do is a half a sheet of uh, Whisper White. And what I'm going to do here, take my pink pirouette. Again, this is a big stamp, so I'm going to layer it. I'm going to load it upside down. And I'm going to stamp half of it there. I'm going to do all my stamp, and then I'm going to run it through the big shot. Now this is, okay, the stamp sets I'm using, of course I used hardwood. But um, Daydream Medallions great set so you see the big the big um, one I the big stamp I just used and then this smaller one is down here in the corner okay, I'm gonna load it it's going over here I can barely see it and then um, with this stamp I am going to stamp right in the center of that pink circle and I'm using Smoky Slate. Here's my Smoky Slate pad. I'm going to line it up. And what I'm doing is taking that um, top and bottom of that stamp and I'm, I'm going to line it up with the top and bottom of this stamp. And try to get it in the middle. And see what happens. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so I have a framelit. Oh, nope, one more thing. I'm going to take this butterfly. I love this set. I love butterflies. And I'm going to take this butterfly out of the Papillion Potpourri. And I'm going to use Smoky Slate. And I'm going to punch, um, stamp it on this side. And then I'm going to take a sponge and I'm going to take the pink pirouette, just kind of color my butterfly. All right, so I now have a punch for my butterfly. Punch it out. I'm using a two and three quarter punch for. The smaller circle, punch it out. Now this I will take and sponge around the edges. Okay, butterfly that. Now this I'm going to run, go cut it out on the big shot, and I'm going to use the uh, floral. And what I'm going to use is the um, second to the biggest. And see how nice it lines up? And I'm going to cut that out on the big shot. I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. And here's the nice cutout that the floral framelits made. Okay, so now it's just kind of putting it together. I'm going to put then this circle. I'm going to use dimensionals on the back. And it just goes in the center. 
this guy, the butterfly, kind of fold them in half. And I'm going to use a glue dot to put him on. And of course a rhinestone. Use my scissors. Put it right on his little head. There we go. Okay, so then the next step is to put this thinking of you on there. Okay, so let's finish this up. Um, all I have to do is now take and put a couple of dimensionals behind the thinking of you. Back here, and we are done. I love this card. It's like a... I like the ocean anyways, but it reminds me of just the sea. I love this card. I liked making it. It was pretty simple. So, hope you enjoyed it. Till next time. Bye.